Hello guys and welcome to Programming Knowledge. Uh, in the previous video, we learned about how to create menu option in a Kinter window. For example, the one which I've created here in the previous video, I'll just show you the output. So this is the uh, menu field which we created with um, basically two functionalities. So for about, it is showing the message box and for file exit it will exit the window so we'll on to we'll move on to the next step that is uh, creating a window within a window so for example after registration after a successful registration i want to uh, redirect or get a new window and which uh, basically is a login window so after a successful registration I want a new window about login that kind of situation so in here I'll just show you a small demo that how you can uh, create a window within a window in Kinter and um, using a, another button so right now there are only two buttons that is sign up and quit so for this we'll be using another button that is a login button and let's create one right now so at the bottom so these are the two sign up and quit button copy one of them and uh, rename it as a login button so it is not basically a login window I'm making here I'm just showing a demo that how you can create one using the approach which I'm telling you right now okay so rename the text login keep it as it is and for right now there is no command okay and we'll uh, place it at 2 and 8 and the y-axis will be around 60 so 60 so let's see the output so as you can see it is in between of this sign up and quit button okay so this is the button which we have created now what we'll have to do is create a function which can be used for opening another window so create a function define and name it as second wind and uh, similarly like the one which we have created that is a first of all we need to create a window object that is when is equal to t k okay then um, put a title to that second window dot sorry title and uh, name it as welcome to second window okay now we'll just provide a simple geometry Uh, we'll just provide this at uh, I guess 250 to 50 and uh, X 200 so this is like a height and the width and uh, now we'll just provide a label we'll just copy or uh, one minute no problem we'll just name it label underscore 
zero two zero two okay then provide a label now when it comes to the second window you don't have to provide the main root window that is over here because it's for that main window now we are creating entirely new kinder window so for that you need to use the root or the window which is provided over here which is taken as the parent object for the kinder frame right okay so we'll be using window comma now text uh, is equal to registration registration so this is basically a label sorry for that i'll just place it inside okay registration successful Okay, so spelling is wrong okay or you can just say it as successful registration completed right okay so this looks good and uh, we'll be providing relief is equal to solid that is for relief is equal to solid comma and uh, we'll just provide font font is equal to Arial I'm mistyping things right okay so we'll just come over here we'll just provide a parenthesis Arial then comma 12 comma bold right and uh, we'll close that too and uh, we'll just place it just cancel this one it is creating an obstacle so place bracket x is equal to on uh, 30 and y is equal to 70 so it is a small window and uh, we also create a small button button underscore zero two or zero one whatever you can name it and we just copy the button down from down here I don't want to type it okay so Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, so second window, right? So just paste it over here, change the position, type it as 80 and uh, 0. Okay, white, okay, no problem. Okay, this is good, this looks good. Okay, so Okay, now here we have to change the window to window and just rename it all. You can provide it as demo button, no problem with that. Again, and with okay, so now this is this looks good, and now we'll just go down to the login button over here and provide that command comma oops command is equal to second win okay so so let's run this and see what is the output okay so there are uh, there is no error right now and we'll click so so as you can see 
there this is an entirely new window now with a label registration completed and a button demo so right now there is no functionality to that button but i'll just provide a simple message box to it so these are two entirely two different window so uh, for the purpose of uh, advancement to this entire registration form one can create a registration form with a certain validation and can redirect it to uh, the second window and provide some entry widgets like um, login name and user password with two entry widgets and a login so this is a basic idea how you can perform so these are two different entire two different windows so this is how you can perform one and i'll just provide a functionality to that button so let me just type in here command is equal to uh, about maybe i'll just check whether it is up or down yep it is definitely up i guess okay so let's see whether it works or not so login this is the second button and let's click on to this demo so as you can see it works so this is the, this is the second window and we have provided a simple function that is a message box to this demo button with a message box right so as you can see this is a basic approach of creating two separate windows from one same window so over here i have created three sign up quit and login and from by clicking login this particular button opens right so this is it for this video guys if you have any more uh, implementation to this existing approach uh, you can use it for further advancement and uh, thanks for watching